Another five-minute mystery. showers this evening. Why do you bother with that radio writing? There's never anything new. What else is there to do around a firehouse eating? Sleep and go to fires. We'll be going to enough fires, all right, if they don't catch that arsonist who's been trying to burn up the whole city. Yeah, I'd like to get my hands on that devil. Maybe we will, Edens. Maybe we will. Holy smoke, here we go again. Watch that baby burn. Looks like the end of the world, doesn't it? They don't get their bloodhounds after that fire bug. It soon will be. Hey, who's that guy the chief's dragging along here? I don't know, but he's really got a grip on his arm. Maybe it's the fire bug. Hey, chief, who's the man you're holding? The rat who's been setting all these fires. Where are you taking him? Down to the station. Put out this place and hurry along. You hear that, Wrighton? Pour on the water. I want to see a fire bug get singed. You still deny that you set that fire? Let me call my lawyer. You can't question me this way. It's illegal. Let me go to work on him, Chief. That won't be necessary, Edens. I'm sure this prolific arsonist will come clean in just a few minutes. You got no proof? You were seen running out of the burning building just as the engines pulled up. How did the fire start? Listen, pal, I'll tell you I don't know. Now will you let me go? Why did you wait till the fire had gained so much headway before you finally ran out? I just woke up and I heard your sirens drawn near the building. Listen, my friend. We're out to break this cycle of arson that's been slowly destroying the city. You're in for some pretty rough weather ahead, unless you come clean and tell me how that fire started. The sooner you give me the truth, the easier it'll go with you. All right, Chief, I'll play ball with you. The whole fire was an accident. What? Yeah, I swear it was. I really went in there to get some sleep. And when I woke up, I lit a cigarette. And that was my big mistake. The building was so old, it was almost falling apart, and there were cobwebs hanging all over the place. While I was shaking out the flame of the match, it hit some of the cobwebs hanging from the low beams, and that was it. Webs caught fire and spread to the roof, and the dry wood began to burn in a flash. What do we do now, Chief? Take him to the police and book him on a charge of arson. His story shows that he deliberately set that fire. What lie in the firebug story did the Chief detect? In just a moment, we'll know, but first... What are you talking about, Chief? I told you it was an accident. If it was, you would have told a different story. You see, there was one very important flaw in your story that condemned it as a lie. Prove it. You said that the cobwebs caught fire and spread to the roof. Well, I'm afraid that isn't quite accurate. Unfortunately for you, cobwebs don't flame. All right, boys, take him away. Our firebug needs cooling off. (laughs) 